Alright, so it's time to check out the uh, multiple dimension parts of this game. So we have Skyward Sword, Twilight Princess, and Ocarina of Time. I'm going to do Ocarina of Time first because I've been wanting to play as Sheik, and Sheik is a playable character in this level. So let's finally do that. I went ahead and leveled her because she's kind of behind. You can just kind of spend rupees on leveling people, thankfully. Leading a small force of Hyrulean soldiers, Impa stepped into one of the newly opened portals. The kingdom spread out before her seemed like the Hyrule she knew, yet it was somehow very different. Before long, she realized that they had traveled back to the era of the mythical hero of time. Awed, Impa began her search for the Gate of Souls. She sensed an evil presence on Death Mountain and set out for the ominous peak. And with her came the mysterious Sheik. Interestingly, we have three people in this world. Uh, we have two people in this world with uh, Impa and Sheik, which are these two characters here. But we only had four characters really up to this point, so in those three paths, two of the people are on their own now. Lana and Link are both completely isolated from the rest of the group, which is a little strange. Looking at the enemies, you just have a bunch of Gorgon captains, so I guess we're going to be fighting Gorgon. Oh, I mean, sorry, not Gorgons. Gorons. Which is interesting. I guess they're not so friendly in this world. Uh. Interesting that they're not straight up the minions of evil, though. Oi. You could have accompanied either Link or Lana. Why did you choose to follow me? Hmm? I can't figure you out. How much do you really know about the Sheikah tribe? Tell me, who is your tribe's leader? Impa, which would be you. Mm -hmm. Correct, and yet there's no one named Sheik in my, in my tribe. So then, who does that make you? What are you really after? Hey, listen! Princess Rudo is in trouble! Not Navi. I swear to God, crush her right now with your bare hands. Rudo, Princess of the Zoras. She was adopted by the Gorons. Their leader... Durania, Durunia used to be such a gentle soul. Someone named Zelda showed up and he hasn't been the same since. Zelda? Princess Zelda's here. That's weird. Let's go and see her with our own eyes. Wait, how do we reconcile... This is gonna be a little weird. How do we reconcile the idea of Sheik and Zelda when we're playing as Sheik right now? I'm concerned about our mission. Something, something, something. Sorry, I missed that. No one can pass through here! <laughs> I beg to differ. I'm really good at passing through areas. Let's see what Zelda, what Sheik's moveset is like. They don't look willing to talk. We'll have to force our way through. Oh my god, I have elemental attacks. You guys are screwed. <laughs> One more step and we'll flatten you with great big boulders. So we can just hit, I can, I can just hit power attack to just activate this mode? Ah, cutscenes. It wouldn't be a Dynasty Warriors game without a boulder trap, would it? I guess it fits here, they didn't pick up a boulder using race. How did I do it a second ago? Huh, weird. Oh, I can summon straight up tornadoes. I mean, sorry, monsoons. We have to stop the falling rocks. Ch capture the boulder keeps in the heart of the mountain. So this is a dead end, so I should just pick a different path, clearly. All right, we'll, captain the ma we'll capture the mountain and capture the boulder keeps. That's not my Hyrule soldier voice. Whoops. <laughs> the hardest thing about doing something where, where I have dumb voices, which aren't even good in the first place. I always thought the Goron were a gentle people. Psych! <laughs> Drug! Apparently. Oh, found the weak spot on, this, on that guy. Darunia, their chief! He's always been so kind! But, what have, but ever since meeting Zelda... He's met Princess Zelda, why would that cost him his senses? Why is Zelda here, also? Oh, I'm getting second poison. Gotta be careful here. Oh, this the keep boss. Let's just go ahead and just wipe him the hell out. What does my special look like? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, it's like a pulsing explosion, implosion, explosion, implosion cycle that just pulls everyone in. That's neat. So I should I should switch weapons to my bow so I can deal with this plant. Hey, plant. Screw you. Get out of here. You can defend that little keep. Yeah, I'm having troubles remembering 
voices I ever even tried to do, which were never good in the first place, just because I'm juggling so many games at once. This, uh, October and November, gonna be fucking crazy for my channel. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with the fact that so many games are coming out. That was, that was the same cool move again. Let's try that again. Is that a four attack? Nope, that's the four attack. So that's four weak attacks followed by strong attack. Let's try three. Nope. Did I just, do I just keep hitting weak attack and does that do the tornado? Nope. One, two, three, four. Super. No, it's just that. Okay. Yeah, we can't advance with those rocks trying to crush us. I can. It's pretty easy. Look, I would use walk in that direction. It's like nailed it. Go grab this key. See, that was so easy, Mr. Hyrulean Captain. You had to run up a hill for a little bit. I don't know what's wrong with you that you can't just do basic actions like this. Silly Dynasty Warriors captains. <laughs> See what's next. Should break. Yep. We should go around to the keep. Now that we've, now that I've taken the uh, spawn point, sort of upset the balance for a second. Come on. It's rough because I. It's this. It's gonna be really weird trying to do anything on this channel for a while because every game, like I play, I play games in a genre where games tend to be longer than normal already, and now all of them are coming out at the same time. This is gonna be a juggling act. Much like all these boulders that are being juggled. Ha ha ha! I'm incredibly clever. Please love me. <laughs> this guy, what is he doing? He's like rolling in place. When am I, when, have I not exposed his weak spot yet? He's gonna die before I expose his weak spot, which is also, you know, totally valid. Uh oh. What's happening there? Okay, nothing is happening there. <laughs> I thought that it was actually gonna like collide with that tower and knock it over. It seemed like it was set up that way. If we don't capture the boulder keeps now, the allied base will be smashed. I'm on it. God, maybe you could do it too. <laughs> All these dang people always relying on me to take care of everything for them. Well, fine, here we go. Giant explosions. Enjoy. Here, enjoy some tornadoes. I mean monsoons. Monsoons, come on! There's only so many explosions I can do in such a small place. I need to really fill up my super. We're getting overwhelmed here! Well, fucking use your shield and sword to fight like people and then problem solved. It's... It's not that hard. Look at me. I killed 400 people. <laughs> Let's see, where's the... There's a boss. There we go. It looked like there was a boss around here somewhere. Just need to pay attention. Use my epic camera skills to notice these things. Come on, key boss. Hyrule's... Some version of Hyrule somewhere is relying on me, so I gotta kill you. Sorry. Although the... All the edges are getting a little blurry here. It's getting hard to understand what, what's going on. Time for that dramatic reveal. It's not a thing. Yay, you got a sealed weapon. We revealed that you'll later find out you got a weapon of some kind. Neat. Power up arrows, power up all those other stuff. Let's get my super back up. There we go. I'm just gonna sprint over to the other. I'm just gonna get over to the other keep as fast as possible since these guys aren't gonna defend themselves very well, apparently. Oh. What's up? Get out of here. I'm trying to poison my people. Hmm, we might be safe if- oops. Missed that entire- God damn it! If only- if only you could press a button that would, uh... That would, like, make text go forward. Like in most games that have text-based dialogue. So that if you hadn't quite read the dialogue yet, it wouldn't go away yet. But nope, so I just missed that. You're setting a fine example. I too must play my part. I'm so proud of myself. I successfully noticed the text message that didn't matter because it was the generic statement about, Hey, you killed stuff! Yep, Hyrule Captain's still getting overwhelmed. I'm tired of saying that, so I'm just gonna stop. <laughs> what a piece of crap. No, it's fine. I like doing everything myself. <laughs> Where's the captain? There he is. Kill that boss. You can't keep up! Well, then fucking pace yourself. Slow and steady wins the race, right? I feel like that's just a lie in general. It's like, yeah, you'll win the race by not moving forward. You know, because all of those people that sprint during races totally just cease moving the moment they get tired. In an actual race, people that are fast... Wonderful, we've stopped the falling rocks. Our base should be safe for now. In an actual race, the people who sprint don't suddenly completely stop moving the moment they get tired of sprinting. They just go to They just start moving slower. Who dares attack the noble Gorons? Whoever you are, prepare to battle the Goron chief captain or chieftain or whatever said. Durania has appeared. We have to knock some sense into that thick head of his. 
How did you know who he was? How did you recognize him? You never met him before, have you? We need him to calm down so we can get some answers. Knock him out! That's one way to calm someone down, I suppose. Just knock a fucker out. <laughs> no, no big deal. We're just going to cause you some brain damage. Maybe if you, you know, just concussion or two. It's casual. I'm sure you can take it. You're like a cartoon character. We can't keep up! Fucking get over yourself. Okay, let's run around to get to that guy. Oh, I see you. Not fall for that. Yeah. Give me all these. Give me your rupees! Let's get to Durani. Oh! Gotta turn around. I was trying to run all the way around to get to Durania. Dur Darunia, sorry. And he jumped right off that cliff, so he's actually nearby. Oh, hey! That's all, I, that's all I have the strength for today. A captain actually got defeated by, uh, like, one of the enemy captains got killed, by, got killed by an allied captain. That never happens. You look like you're in a bad mood. Do you need aspirin? Oh. He needs Tums for that for that heartburn. Flaming weapon joke. I'm a jackass. I'm an utter jackass. I'm so sorry. I'm not actually sorry at all, though. I'm actually, I'm so, I'm like mildly proud of myself for how dumb that was. Come on, Durania. Don't mind me just casually beating on you with a harp, because I'm that awesome. What, what allied base is at risk of falling? Our home base is at risk of falling? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm kind of busy fighting the boss for a second here. Can't you guys just take care of yourself? Don't, don't mind me, I'm just casually uh, exploding all of his weaknesses and just completely obliterating this dude. That dash is so nice. Kinda, kinda gives me a feeling of what Bloodborne's gonna feel like a little bit, because Bloodborne is all about the dodging. They took away all forms of shields. As far as I know, Bloodborne has no shields in it, and you have to just dodge every single attack. So, it'd be good, it'd be good practice for people to play do playthroughs right now of Dark Souls and Dark Souls 2 and Demon Souls without shields, where they just dodge roll everything, because that's gonna that's the feature of that franchise, apparently. At least the immediate feature. Is Durania dead? He is not dead yet. He's going down though. I will I will flatten this guy. Makes it, I don't know. <laughs> I lost that sentence. It's just that that was a terrible idea. That was a bad I, I should have waited for him to actually Oh, yeah. There we go. That's when I should have done the special when he had when he had a vulnerability. I totally wasted my opportunity by using my special when he was just totally normal strength. That said, unless this is gonna be a multiple part fight, this is a really, really easy boss so far. Rania, I think I got you. You don't seem to stand much of a chance against me. As long as as long as my allied base doesn't just magically get itself. Oh, there we go. I need to figure out how exactly to do that uh that crazy whirlwind ability. I somehow not managed to properly figure out how it works. So I'm not sure what the requirement is for it. Oh, dang it! I just totally missed his weak spot because he stunned me. So I get for not dodging. That said, clearly, yep. Clearly I'm on top of things. So Durania's down. There's the fight over. The fight's not over because our UI is still here. Not bad. I'll have to withdraw for now. But only so I can strike back twice as hard. Durania's temporarily retreated from the chief's to the chief's room. Well, we'll have to chase him all the way there then. Grr. He got away. Who says grr? Like, actually says it in a sentence. This seems like a weird thing to do. Let's see. Yeah, they're fighting a handful of guys. It's fine. It's fine. Big Brother Darudia, we're on it. Aw, you can tell. I can tell how much he loves all of you by the fact that you don't have names. <laughs> oh, don't. Oh, well, yeah. Looks like we have a bit of a fight on our hands. We're trying to take my keeps, so I, I need to target their captains as fast as possible before they manage to actually successfully take something over. Lamo, hey, like that, huh? All your organs will rearrange from that concussive blast of my fucking fist. <laughs> Actually, it's more of a concussion blast with my crazy explosions. Snarf! Smack! Oh, ah, that's better. I can feel my strength returning. I bet that he's eating something. He's probably eating something that's making him crazy. Yes, I'm back to fighting strength. Brothers, we're marching out again. This guy's reminding me of Meng Huo from, uh... And I don't care if I'm mispronouncing that because it's hard to pronounce all his Chinese names. He has completely restored his strength. If this carries on, we don't have a hope of winning. How in the world is he regaining health? The secret must lie within the Goron base. Well, guess where I'm going next? Ha <laughs> ha. I've got a plan. First, let's head for that keep. Which which keep? Oh, that keep? I already, well, I already took over that keep. Guard that keep. Our plan requires it. Ah. 
Well, that sounds tedious. I'd rather run around and slaughter everybody. Okay. I'll go defend that keep. Oh, there's a spider around here somewhere. Is that the spider? I don't see it. Nope. That's all I have the strength for today. I don't know where the sp would look for the spider necessarily. Spider. Oh, hey, hey, Darunia. How you looking? How you doing? You have a good old, jolly old time? Impressive. I rule is fortunate to have you. Wow, thousand kills already. That was fast. I feel like it's easier than normal to get a lot of kills really quickly in this game. It's probably because all the enemies are smaller than normal because they're all little cartoon characters. So they they really like pack off. They are they are really crap the small areas. Enjoy my shockwave, buddy. Yes. Oh, I broke. I think I broke his uh, weakness too. When that happened, they get bonus damage from that. There we go. He is taking. He's taking damage slower than before, isn't he? Shoot, shoot him with the bow. Get out of my way. I won't be slowed down. Is that? He's not taking much damage from that. Is either is he? I'm supposed to cover Impa's march, but I'm busy defending this place for. Okay, brothers, show them the strength of the Goron peoples. So I'm supposed to defend uh, Impa's march, but also protect this heat from the incoming everything else. Okay, this is a little wacky. Don't mind me, just casually killing your leader. If you leave Darunia to his own devices, I mean Darunia to his own devices, he's bound to cause us more trouble. I'm not leaving him to his own devices. I'm, you, I mean, you know that, because you're, because you, I'm you. I'm obliterating him right now. This dude has some hit points. Chill. We'll get to it. <laughs> What has fallen? Oh, the far right one? That one doesn't matter, though. A little bit of a bummer, because I already tip over that one, though. Let's have to do it again. Nope, you're not, you're not throwing boulders at me. We can't keep up! Fucking... Okay. I just... I have no sympathy for the captains. <laughs> and they're just nonsensical. Nonsensical. Just useless activity, really. No! Is the east boulder keeps about to follow. That's, isn't that the one that I'm defending? Yeah, please finish this guy off. Before I lose the keep. Oh, well, I lost the gold sculpture. That's fine, though. I've more or less committed to not getting them anyway. Darunia, no! There it goes. Darunia's down. Do I get a drop from him? Is he gonna drop something? Nope, not, not apparent. Apparently not. Let's quickly get to that keep before it falls. So I was distracted. Oh, okay, that's that's just him retreating. Alright. Come on, guys, face me. This keep is gonna be mine. You don't get to take it from me. Get I'm chic. I'm a scary person in leather. <laughs> you don't want to. You don't want to fuck with a lady wearing leather and a harp. <laughs> the implications here potentially concerning. So many identical-looking Gorons. They're adorable. They look like the, they look like the main character creature from Castle Story, which is this like real-time strategy-style Minecraft game. That's in, I think it's still in early access. Uh, Actually, it's one of the only games I ever backed on Kickstarter, and unfortunately, when it finally came out with a beta version I could play, I was like, this is like, I can't even make, like, a thing, I can't even make, like, a guy pick up a thing, like, I can't do the basic actions in this game. It's all the strength I have for today. I like that, uh, apparently, captains are dying all over the place, just on their own, perhaps. Okay, now that's taken care of, let's hurry over to Impa! Because she's apparently incapable of defending herself, and so I have to clear the path for her. She's clearly not doing it herself. Don't you roll away from me. We fight. There we go. Dead yet? Nope, you're not dead yet. You dead now? Oh yeah, now he's dead. There we go. That's what you get when you let your heart win. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I can't open this from the side, can I? Oh, well, this is a bummer. And there's a, there's a flower in there, too. It's probably causing all of the problems. So this whole time I've been waiting for Impa to show up, and I, oh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Literally, as I walked away, uh, Impa took over that keep, and it became it became our side. Just when I was about, to, uh, I, I'm happy. I was about to run around the entire goddamn map to get there, and that was going to be a huge pain in the ass. The Allied base is suffering from boulder attacks. Oh, whoops! The other boulder keep is taken over again. Clip through. We must rec reclaim the boulder keeps. Our base is in danger. I'm on it, Impa! Don't worry, I'm really, really fast, so I'll probably be on it in a second. Quickly, take over the boulder keeps. Our base will be crushed if we don't. I like that they did the straight up, like, the, the ridiculous ninja run on this character. It's the same way that Sheik runs in uh, Super Smash Brothers. It's also the really comical way that, like, everyone in Naruto runs. Believe it! 
Everyone just runs with their arms flailing behind them like they don't have or like they don't have muscles in them anymore. Mmm, I'm all better. Good, let's go! Ah, uh, that boss is right here for round three. Now we know why the boss isn't very hard, because he's persistent. He comes he even comes back over and over again. Let's see how quickly I can get the captain to show up so I can take over this keep. Where's the keep where's the leader? There we go. Let's just super him into oblivion. Hey bro! Hi! But yeah, he definitely... Everything's ready! Begin! Uh, Darunia definitely reminds me of uh, Neng Huo from uh, Dynasty Warriors. Pretty much every Dynasty Warriors. He's the leader of the Nanman tribe. I think he was introduced in Dynasty Warriors 4? They're essentially the locals. Oh, well that made a big boom. Oh jeez, I, I just kicked their door down with that. Okay. Well, let's get up there before... Oh! No time for them boulders. Hey, what's going on? That's what I should have been doing. I, I shouldn't be trying to do, like, gravelly evil voice. I should be, like, do the big oafish voice for all the Gorons. I'm really hungry. <laughs> okay, let's switch to the... Clearly, we need to switch to the bombs here. There we go. Hey, it's a secret. Ah, the, oh, I missed that. Rah! You just got between a rock and a hard place. Gorons, move out. I completely ignored my own thing of not saying... I'm not dumb enough to attack a chicken in a Zelda game. That's not happening. Oh, right! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah, I've learned the hard way from... Because I, I did briefly play... It actually probably wasn't that brief, but I played Oracle of Seasons. The Rooney won't be able to regain stamina anymore. It's time to take him down. Hey, bro. You got a Baba on your base. Uh, there we go. Oh, arrows. Let's blow up their base with a bomb chew! Uh, where's their bomb chew? I can't let that happen. Oh, oh cool, that's the conveni- the bomb chew is conveniently nearby. I can take care of that. Oh, there, there it is. It's right there. The bomb chew is right there. Okay, I, I'm sorry to keep the base, I'd love to give you attention, but I gotta do after the, the, bomb chew, the bomb chew. The famous Goron bomb chew. Something, something, something. We need to stop it before it gets to the base, I assume she said. God damn. It's gonna be, it's quite the exercise trying to keep track of all the text that comes up on screen in this game. Uh, I'm used to the amount of dialogue, but in every Dynasty Warriors game, normally it's fully voice acted in English. So you don't have to actually read it all as it comes up. It's kind of sensory overload a bit. Oh, jeez, that was an explosion. A bomb, she was approaching the base. Oh, there, there's another one. Oh God, is there another one on the other side too? How many bombers are there? Okay, this is good. This is a problem to deal with. Yep, got something bomb shoes. It looks like it must, there must be two on every side. They're not that hard to get. They're not that hard to kill, but it's definitely a bit of a time commitment to actually reach them. So I gotta go reach the other one. Somebody must be killing the bomb shoe. We have to find and defeat whoever it is. Oh, bomb shoe operator. That narrows it down. I think we figured it out. There's a very complicated puzzle, and I worked on it for decades, but I eventually solved it. You're welcome, everybody. You're setting a fine example. I too must play my part. I, it's only 1600 kills, it's no big deal. It only take like a few centuries to repopulate the number of deaths I've created. It's a morbid way of looking at it, isn't it? Okay, bomb shoes all the way down there. I need to run for it for sure. Oh, come on. They took over, they freaking took over my, uh, the base again. Qu quickly, we must rec reclaim the boulder keeps. Our base is in danger. Man, they're really lucky to have me around because I... No one else on this team could keep up with the amount of the amount of damage that I do. Is there a is there a bomb chew over here? Bomb chew operator. Here we go. Take this guy out as fast as possible. Is he down? Is there, is there any other bomb chew around here? Uh, hi everybody. I'm gonna just, don't don't mind me. I'm just gonna catch you. Take over your base for a second. Okay, I need to get to that side base as fast as possible because there's definitely a bomb chew over there. Uh, keep, where are you? There's, there's a keep boss. On, wipe him the hell out. There we go, 70, 1700 KOs. I am just destroying the balance of, like, gender and age in this population. It's gonna be like post-World War, where all the 20-year-olds are dead, and all the men are dead. So there's, like, too many women, too many old people. It fucks up the whole population. There we go, that plant's out of the way. Is the bomb shoe operator. We took a hit. Does the base still stand? Who took a hit? What? Oh, cool. I actually got control of this bomb shoe. That's cool. Uh-oh. <laughs> bomb shoe just changed sides. 
A bomb shoe headed towards the Goron Keep. Awesome. That sounds like fun. Okay, let's check the map. How many bomb shoes are on the board right now? Is there another one? Oh, wrong thing. Is there another bomb shoe somewhere? Oh god, the bomb shoe operator is right there. Okay, guess he's going for a run. Oh my, okay, let's go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everybody. I didn't notice that one. There's a lot of bomb shoes, and they're just represented by red dots, which is just what all the bad guys look like, so it's actually a little hard to recognize when enough bomb shoes in the, around the area. Get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. There's a the Goron Captain. That's not the bomb shoe operator, though. He must still be out here. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Okay, so that should be all the bomb shoes taken care of? What's over here? That's just some random assholes? Okay. Whew, we got this. I'm gonna go for a nice jog up towards the base now. Clearing that up a bit. That, uh, got problematic, didn't it? Oh, the bomb shoes there, too. I should catch up with the bomb. Oop! Yellow pot and fulfill my super. There we go. I need to get to that bomb shoe as quickly as possible before he gets defeated on the way. This is a... This is an especially chaotic level, isn't it? There is so much going on with multiple enemies. You have to capture all these different bases in order to attack the enemy base with the boulders and also depend on the boulders from coming in after you. And then you simultaneously have to... Oh, cool. That keep ahead of me just got automatically captured by the bomb shoe. All bomb shoes have exploded. So it looks like if I killed all the operators instead of killing the... Uh, I feel as if the sorceress is behind this. Could she be controlling the Gorgons? Defeat the big pose to remove Tyrannia's uh, enchantments? What's a big Poe? I guess I'm about to find out. Are those big Poe's? Hi, big Poe. You're about to get wrecked. Don't mind me. Just kind of destroying you. Ooh, cool. Tyrannia got caught in that explosion, too. Oh, I meant for you to lock onto the big Poe. That was an interesting direction for you to attack in. Mr. Popo is getting wrecked. Come on. Just gotta finish them off. So if I'd gone for all those choo-choo, <laughs> this choo-choo, yeah, the choo-choo rocket. Uh, if I went for all the, if I went for all the bomb, the bomb chew, uh operators right off the bat, instead of attacking any of the bomb shoes, I would have actually been able to turn all the bomb shoes around and automatically capture a bunch of enemy bases without doing the work myself. So next time I play this level, and which wouldn't be in the series, but just me on my own, we're getting overwhelmed here. If I play this game, on, this level on my own in the future, that'll definitely be the thing to do is to. Take out the operator so that the bomb crews just turn around and just do awesome stuff for me. Question for me though is if they needed an operator to go after my base, why does not having an operator make them turn around and attack their own bases? Because I don't think anything was operating the bomb shoe when it was on my team. So that's a little odd. Oh, he's not down yet. Take care of that guy. You defeated the big pose. Daruni Daruni's power is decreased. Alright. Daruni, where you at, bro? I can use a little reinforcements, actually. Let's see, can I capture more? Let's capture this other outpost here. Defeat Daruni to re re uh, regain his sanity. Was that a plot point in Oracle of Time? I've never actually played it. Uh, was there a was there a boss Goron that you had to beat, and then he's like, all right, now I'm normal now? Because that seems like it could almost be a repeat of a plot point of the original or something. Is this also an outpost over here? All right, I control this already. This is what the bomb she took over. All right, here we go. Let's get over to Daruni now that I now that I sort of alleviated the difficulties a little bit. Hey, Darunia, you having a good time? You like party? <laughs> yes, it's me. Capitalize on this. Ah, oh, he it, it, uh, he recovered too quickly. My bad. Probably because I didn't do a cool enough power attack. Either way, defeat this guy at least twice now. I can defeat him a, a third time. There we go. Break that special. Darunia. Come here, boy. You wanna play? <laughs> I love that. I love the monster attack. It's like, you need a bath! No, not the bath! Our people don't like water! Now I'll never find a man because I don't smell like a man! Or something like that. <laughs> Take a bath! Come here. Oh, I, that, 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 that didn't. Okay, Monsoon is not a good strategy for taking. It's really funny. Monsoon is really funny looking, but it's not a, a valid strategy for weakening his, uh. For taking care of his income, his uh, what is it, his weak spot, because it does not do a lot of damage to it. Oh, that keep that I, the bomb took over is about to fall. Probably because none of my allied soldiers have come here. In fact, where are any? Wow, if you look at the map, my allied soldiers are basically nowhere. They're in a handful of bases, but they're not doing anything. That's super weird. 
Like, they had one job. Try to help me beat the boss. Like, right? That's, that's their only thing, is keep pushing forward. But no one's pushing forward. They're just hanging out in their bases trying to defend them. Which is why the, the base that's on the very front is doing so poorly. And no one's coming to help it. Alright. This sounds like a good time for a... My, to finally use my, my magic for the first time. Somebody send us support! I'll do... I'll, I'll one-up that. I'll defeat the boss. How's that, how does that sound like for support? Darunia, you're in trouble, because I'm in super crazy mode. And I don't like people that keep trying to oppose me when I'm trying to wreck everything in the world. Hey, buddy. Here comes the super. Did I win? I think I won. Cool. I beat the level in the most dramatic way possible with the super, the super attack that I only use at that moment. There we go. Garuni is defeated. Huh? We surrender. We give up. I didn't realize what we were doing. Forgive us. So I was twisting our minds. <laughs> why do you... Why do you... Would you mind kindly releasing Princess Ruto? Oh, yeah, of course, man. I feel terrible for everything we've been doing. <laughs> oh, there's Darunia. The crazy Aquantus-looking character. Well, that was a terrible experience. I am Ruto, Princess of the Zoras. You want to know what caused this? I'll explain. But not until we leave this filthy mountain. That sounds vaguely racist. What do you got against mountain people, huh? Huh? Zora? What do you got against the mountain people, Zora? I'm shoving her around. I'm just pushing her. Just kind of casually just shove her around the map. <laughs> oh. Victory is at hand. And I'm only mildly psychotic in the process. So Sheik is fun to play as. I like her magic abilities. Although my favorite character might still be playing as a Link. With this big, broad sword that just wrecks everything. There's something to say about just simple, wide-reaching attacks that just nail everything. Weapon Tang. Big Goron's knife. Sword created from the finest Goron smithy who ever lived. It slices deep, but requires immense strength to wield. Press the strong attack qu button quickly to dash to enemies. Oh, it's it's for, uh... It's for Impa. I guess I'll have to give, try that weapon out when I'm playing as Impa next. It's interesting, there's only a handful of characters in this game, but they have multiple weapons, and those weapons have their own movesets, so it's like having... It's definitely like having more characters. At least if you can count movesets as characters, because that's what I'm used to thinking of them as as a Dynasty Warriors player. You can now battle as Darunia. We just keep unlocking characters faster than I can play them, don't we? Magic Hammer. A special happy hammer for Darunia's use only. Use the strong attack button to charge at enemies, hit an enemy to lock onto that enemy, allowing you to follow up with more strong attacks. Alright, so let's play as... probably play as a Goron Chief next if he's available in the next mission. It's a lot of... it's a lot of codex, codex entries. I'm not here to read, I'm here to play video games. Which is not an accurate thing to say, because all I've been doing all day is reading people's... is <laughs> reading people's text, which is reading! So I guess I'm a liar. I'm sorry. Looks like next up, though, we'll have another... oh no. Oh no, Ocarina of Time, the Water Temple, that's the most infamously... That's that's the that's the level that pisses everybody off in Ocarina of Time. I guess we're gonna have some fun next episode, aren't we? Thanks for watching.